point fingers at each other over U.S. ship presence in South China Sea. China and the United States, U.S., are blaming each other over the South China Sea dispute. The Chinese military said it expelled a U.S. warship that the U.S. Navy said was conducting a routine sailing navigation operation. According to a post on the official WeChat social media account of the Southern Theater Command of the Chinese People's Liberation Army on Saturday, 16 by 12, the Chinese military deployed its Navy and Air Force to track, monitor, and warn the U.S. to strong. The U.S. Navy said on Sunday, 17 by 12, that the presence of the warship named Hopper asserts navigation rights in the South China Sea near the Paracel Islands. China claims almost all of the South China Sea, which is home to more than $3 trillion in annual ship trade, including parts claimed by the Philippines, Vietnam, Indonesia, Malaysia, and Brunei. The permanent court of arbitration in 2016 said China's claims had no legal basis. The Philippines and Australia began their first joint sea and air patrols in the sea on Saturday, 25 by 11, days after Beijing accused Manila of asking foreign troops to patrol the South China Sea. The accusation refers to joint patrols by the Philippine and U.S. militaries. Regarding this weekend's incident, China said it proves the United States is a real security risk creator in the South China Sea. Lieutenant Christina White. Deputy spokesperson for the U.S. 7th Fleet said in an email statement, the United States opposes excessive maritime claims around the world regardless of the identity of the claim. Unlawful and widespread maritime claims in the South China Sea pose a serious threat to freedom of the sea. China earlier held talks on maritime issues, including the South China Sea dispute, during which the U.S. underscored concerns about what it called dangerous and unlawful Chinese actions. The U.S. State Department said 